You ain't about it. You ain't a rider, fuck boy. You a biter. Your main bitch slid up beside her. For your niggas, would you ride? Would you ride or die? It's your boy KJ, and I'm not gonna say my actual intro because this is a little bit more sentimental, and this is dedicated to my baby T. You know, I'm not gonna say your full name, but you know exactly who you are, Mrs. Perez. You hear me? So, y'all, I had to come here because I've been thinking about doing this for a long time. I procrastinated because. You know, just some stuff she and I have talked about. You know what I'm saying? And this woman means everything to me. And I tell her this every day, literally. Um, so I'm confessing it right now. So that's why I'm here with y'all. Um, T, I'm about to do a whole monologue about you. About us. About you specifically, but us. Um, so y'all, I wanted to come here. I always gave y'all bits and pieces about what's going on. You know, some stuff is not for the internet, like my babe say. And she's right. She's absolutely correct. Some stuff is meant to be in private, meant to be in my heart, meant to be memory, you understand? Um, so... I'll say a little bit how I first met T. So, I was on live like how I am now. I'm not on live, but this is a hypothetical. And um, the numbers was doing numbers, baby. They were doing numbers. We hit like uh, 7,000, 7 to 13,000, somewhere in there. And that's a big, big thing for me. It was going crazy. The, the numbers was number and like my songs say I stay doing numbers I do it in the slumber keep yeah yeah make sure y'all go run them numbers up on my music but my baby out of all the people my babe was the one that stuck out you hear me I'm telling y'all but let me take y'all back a little bit before this so I'm in the United States right now but I live in Thailand right so, I was in Thailand, you know, feeling displacing and just feeling unfulfilled. Like, I needed my helpmate, my wife, my queen, the mother of my children. I, I want somebody to hug and hold on to something scrumptious. And, and I'm like, I'm praying to God, I'm like, Lord, you know... I need somebody that's for me, only me specifically. I always wanted a woman that didn't have no children, but wanted children. And um, so, it's crazy because this playlist, I didn't even play it before, but it's kind of, go and coincides with that love life that I have for my baby, my wife. So, you know, I had booked my ticket and I was like, you know what, I need to get back to the United States because I need to come do some stuff here. And so, at that point, 
you know, I took a flight. I literally, I sat for hours, y'all. I was in the Philippines for damn near 40 hours. I said, Lord, I felt like I was a foreigner coming back to the United States to find my wife like they do from where they from. <laughs> so anyway, so I came to um, the United States and I said all that time, I was getting so tested heavily in the Philippines. Like tested like it ain't nobody business, Lord. I'm so glad he spared me and carried me through. So, it was just a bunch of confusion, but we ain't finna get the devil no glory, right? So boom, I finally get home. It was a struggle getting home in the United States to my crib right here. Anyway, we gonna keep on moving forward. Y'all like me, y'all know me, I like to be progressive. So boom, I get to the airport I finally find somebody to give me a place um, in the cab of my price range. Cool guy, laid back. You know the New York way. That he tried to end, end me up to get more, to pay more. No, I didn't take it. So, boom. I get home. My hair was in disarray. All the stuff was strolled around my apartment, everything. And then so boom, I you know I didn't do nothing for the first initial two weeks, and then so at that point, um, so at that point, I just was like doing stuff around the house, ordering food, you know, little shit like that. I didn't get out at all, so I was still looking raggly, man, for like that whole time, y'all, that whole. So, um, at that point, I started getting on TikTok. I was still jet lagged for a while, y'all. It took me, it took me a little minute to get back in the groove of things. I don't know how long it took me to adjust here, because in Thailand, they're a day ahead of us. Allegedly. So, boom. So... I had started, you know, doing what I do. I started getting back to me slowly but surely, y'all. And so, um, I was like, I was like, um, so I had did this one live. This live, I was just talking to everybody. We was turned and, um, it was just fun. We was on there for like, three, I was on there for like, I, I'm talking about we like I wasn't the host. But it was we because it was the other people through the internet. So I was on I was on there for like three and a half hours. And um, I should have downloaded it. It was so freaking fun, y'all. It was fun. So this female, I'm like, yo, she was just, she was just making her way through the crowd. Like, yo, I want that one. She was like, like, she was one of them. She was one of them. Like, yo, 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 yo. You know how you wave the stick and you say how much you want to bid on something for? That's how she was getting my attention. 10000 2000 1800 30000 you know, type thing. So, I'm like, go on, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, I want to get that jacket that you made and created. I want that in pink. I want that one, you know. So I'm like, yo, who is this? So I'm like, you know, okay, ah, uh, ah, uh, uh. So boom. So my baby was like, so my baby was like, um, still, she wasn't satisfied. She wasn't stopping until she got my undivided attention. Now, mind y'all, I told y'all it was a lot of people in my life. <laughs> so, um, <laughs> the internet was again broke in by the king. You hear me? So, boom, finally. So, I said, you, so I, I picked up my other device. I said, and I'm still on live like this. So, the female 
So Babe was still doing her thing. So I started, I said, you know what? So I looked to see what her name was. So I'm, I'm going to her page real quick. So I'm looking, so, so I'm going to base and stuff. So I'm like, okay. So I was like, man, she cute. I'm like, yo, she got a pretty face. She thicker than a, she way thicker than a Snickers. You hear me? She a whole factory for me. So I started, you know, doing my thing up on her, under her thing. Like, yo, you cute, what's good? Is this mine? Question mark, her eyes and putting the, the flag to let her know that, you know, a nigga is less FTM. She already seen that because I ain't have my, no breasts or whatever. And then she was like, oh, she said she was peeping me for a couple of days. So I'm like, okay. Uh, so I'm like, damn, she got some pretty ass eyes. Her eyes are real fucking pretty. It's so crazy because I'm going to be dropping this song that I wrote about her. So what well, I wrote about you, babe, because, you know, I'm talking to you specifically and everybody else, but I'm talking to you specifically. But y'all, so, you know, she was like hyping me up. I'm like, yo, what's good? You know? So I got in her box. She didn't say nothing for me for almost two weeks, y'all. I'm like, oh, uh uh. So I got back in her box. I got back in her DMs, like, yo, what's good? Why you dubbing me? And she said something. I don't remember what she said. She was like, I ain't dubbing you. Stop. Don't do that. You know, type shit. So I'm like, all right, yeah. So I was feeling her heavy. Like when I started going through her stuff and seeing like how she gyrating and maneuvering shit, I was like, I was like, yo, yo, shorty, come do that on Poppy. Come do that on Poppy. Come sit that thick ass right here on my lap. So I can hold you. You know what I'm saying? So like my bay is short and I'm tall, as y'all know. But so my girl is tall. I mean, I'm tall, but she's short. She like average for a female, but still short, you know. So I'm one of them people like I'm sitting down, baby, you come sit on my lap. You know, either you gonna come in, in between my legs and you got your both of your legs like this, or you sitting down and you got your your butt on my leg and you got your other leg thrown over my leg right here. So I'm holding you like this. You know, I'm holding your son, I'm my my arm around her waist, so right here. And um, I'm holding like I'm holding on to it like this because I like I like um, I have my own um, love language, you know, which is touch, affection, and you know, just to make my my woman feel good. And I love to protect and do stuff for my wife. You know what I'm saying? I love a female that keep her nails done, her feet done. Like you know, I love that. That is so attractive to me. I'm a, I'm a hand and feet nigga, baby. I love a female with some beautiful feet. What? And some beautiful fingers. Like me, I show you. I got some pretty fucking fingers. I got pretty, I got some big hands too, y'all. I got some big fingers. You know, I got some pretty hands. They soft too. And I got some pretty feet. Maybe I put a, uh, my feet up in here. Even, I don't know, probably not. Cause y'all go crazy over that shit. Y'all some nasty niggas. But uh, I'm a nasty nigga too. But for her, but for her, yo. <laughs> so, but uh, now nah, I don't think I'm gonna put it in there because this is about my wife. So, so boom. So time progressed. So we finally. So my girl, so my lady, she don't like to call my girl. I just say my girl. I don't know. But so my lady, um, we started talking. Conversation was bueno. Mwah. Hey, man, listen, when I tell you she was the first female in years, and I mean, and I literally mean what I say, y'all, babe, I'm going to say it personal. Let's get more intimate. Babe, you was the first woman in years to bring the conversation, the humor, the consistency, the support. I love that. You jumped in your role immediately. That's why I love everything about you, T. Bro, if I could, and you was right here, I would get on one knee and ask you to marry me. Man, what? I would go up there and get your joint. You already know what I'm talking about, babe. 
So I love that about you. I love everything about you, man. And then the private stuff that we talked about that I'm not gonna say. And our kids, our children. Yo. And our baby had your color eyes and my dimples. But hey, you already know, mama. Call me, baby. Forgive me. Give me another chance. Man, I'd do anything to have your love. I want to marry you. You know this dating scene sucks. You said it on live the other day. The dating scene sucks, baby. Yo, King is right here. I'm right here, babe. I'm right here, baby. You ain't got to look no further. Poppy is right here. You my, man, listen, you, you my red. And I'm still, I don't care if you call it weird or not. I'm going to still get you tattooed right here. I'm getting your face tattooed right there, straight up. And I put my mama right beside you. Straight up. I'm, I'm getting you tatted. So, call it weird, call it what you want. I got your name already tattooed on me, too. What can you really say? But, um, anyway, so, you know. You know, we was we talking on the phone every day, all day. I love that. Oh, man. That is such a turn on for me. I love that shit. I'm my, my, my wife at work, not only is she at work, but we talking all day. And, um, um, unless it's something that she needed to get done. And I, she like, okay, I'm calling you back. But we texting. We talking. We communicating. 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 That open line of communication is such a big, important thing, yo. I'm telling you. So, time progressed, time progressed, time progressed. All right, so we're going to fast forward a little bit. So, we start talking about, you know, wedding, what we want, how she want me to look. Um, I'm going to put some of that stuff up in here. I really don't want to expose it, but it'll mean a lot to me. So, T, call me, please. Or unblock me. So I could tell you, like, if it's cool, if I could release these pictures, I don't want to do it before you say yay or nay, but they need to go in here. So I might have to shit. That's why I hate that. I'm blocked on everything and you don't return my call. Fuck. Anyway, so, um, so when I tell y'all quickly, she, um, she, Picked my hairstyle from when we got, when I got married. But when we was getting married, yo, I'm telling you, I loved it. She had the pictures in her phone. I'm not sure if she had them for somebody else or she did somebody. Man, she got them immediately. She got the colors that we were going to be wearing for our wedding, everything. If I die, all I know is I'm a motherfucking legend. It's too late. I'm telling you. I'm telling him. Y'all. I'm telling you, it's nothing like my wife. It's nothing like her. So look, I'm about to put this little collage together. It's not going to be everything. But this is what I respect from her. I love everything about her. I love you so much, T. I almost said your name. <coughs> I love you, mama. Call me. Give me another chance. I'm not trying to move forward without you. I want your hand in marriage. We could have a small, intimate wedding and a big-ass reception. Man, do you know... Baby, I'm going to be honest. Do you know I ran into a female... She was like, oh, I know how to cook, but I don't cook. What? There's nobody who can compare to you, T. The way you cook, the way you got them smell good, the way you move. My, listen to me. You put that ass on me. Put it on my face. I'm going to keep that there, but you know what I'm talking about. I ain't gonna disrespect you like that on the net, but you know what I'm saying. You, we already talked about that. You already know. You know what type of time I'm on. And my baby is a hardworking woman. That other female, I'm like, ugh. I said, that's why I don't want to progress with nobody else. It ain't nobody that can compare to you, love. 
Nobody. You man, look, I wouldn't want no kid no kids with no other female. Man, you beautiful. I'm handsome. We too good looking at we don't have beautiful children, babe. Call me. We gonna have some beautiful kids. And we already know what nationality we already said. You know what I'm saying? Girl, ain't nobody touching our children. All three of our kids is gonna be gorgeous, healthy, intellectual geniuses. I've been praying for our kids, a family that prays together, stays together. All I need you to do is call me so we can pass this out. And I'm immediately I'm I'm asking for your hand in marriage. You ain't gotta wait for nothing. We can get this back. I ain't going to rush like I did before. I ain't. But I know you my fiance. And I'm ready to make that official. On everything that I love. And I love you. So yeah, y'all. If you get your wife, don't fumble that. Don't cheat. I ain't going to cheat. I never cheat on her. I would never cheat on her. I would never disrespect her in front of another female. They gonna know that she my wife. That's a fact. Ain't nobody ever gonna take my wife's face. I love you, baby. Y'all, there's another thing that I want to say real quick. My wife is a silent supporter. I don't have to say why, but she knows what I'm talking about. Baby, I thank you so much. That video that you like, thank you. I love you. I love you so much. You hear me? I mean that from the top, the in between, and bottom of my heart. Thank you so much, mama. I love you, dude. I do. I love you, boo. And you, you, you got my word, T. I will never disrespect you like that again. You give me another chance, I promise on my, our unborn children life, on my life, I will never disrespect you like that again. I'm stepping about you from back side to side. When I move, you move. I'm holding you like this. I'm holding you like this. I'm holding you like this. We, we moving together, a unit. You got my word, baby. You got my word, T. Tell the hudo. That means I promise in Spanish. I love you. Give me one more chance, baby. I will never fuck that up again, man. I'm so serious, mama. I will protect you and our children. At any and by all means necessary. I'm, I'm so serious. I love you, team. I'm ready to make you Mrs. Perez. I love you, team. I'm so serious. I love you, baby. Yo, when I tell y'all, when I seen that video she liked, oh my God, I love that. Thank you so much, T. You really do be supporting me, even now you do. Even now you still support me. Everybody don't gotta know shit but us. Pop is real heavy, rock the launcher on stage. I wish y'all happy Chappers breathing baby. holiday. This gotta your boy, get, hey, get, get, get I need y'all to do me a favor. Make sure y'all run these numbers up. Sub to me on all platforms. I'm in love with the money. Get these up. Let me know where you from, where you tapping in at. Leave comments below. Make sure you go check out my podcast. So I interview up and coming artists. Make sure you add me on YouTube. The link is in my bio up there. Make sure y'all follow me on all platforms. Follow your boy, King, you heard? Um, If you want to interview, send me your stuff. I'll check you out and i get back at you because after 2021, I'm charging. Yes, this is my brand. This shit is for real. This is my bread and butter, you heard? You need video shot for your music? Holla at your boy. You need a photo shoot done? Cop your hoodies for you and your girl right now. You know it's cuddle season. Get your t-shirts and enjoy it during the fall season. You want your hair done? Hit me up. I am available for hire wherever you're located. Available for purchase now are King Royalty Trio Clippers. You have the selection of the knight in shining armor. 
And we also have the rose gold right here that you're able to cop. All lovely. Shot with me at Royal Abundance Beauty Co. Check us out on TikTok. Available now. We have our Royal Trees Beauty Collection. Check us out. Available on our store. Don't forget about the children. We have our Desires Princess Touch Collection for the children. Ages 2 up to the 20 ages. Last and not least, well, we have our Kingdom Rain Collection. You want to cop this, his and hers, unisex. We got them in all sizes from small, extra small, up to 6X. Yes, 6X, y'all. You ain't about it. You ain't a rider, fuck boy. You a biter. Your main bitch slid up the slider.